<sighs> I don't know where I should start from. Um, okay, hello and welcome back to this YouTube channel. If you are new here, kindly consider subscribing down below and also make sure that you like this video and also my uh, and also watch my other videos that i do i also do haul videos i also do plug videos and i do uh house tour videos i do makeover videos so check them out and i hope you're going to love those videos so this is an emotional video that i'm doing um I need help and the reason why I need help is because um, I've given up I feel like um, I don't know I don't know what I should do next because one of how my skin is behaving I don't know if it's visible this side That is how my skin looks like I have scales I don't know if this is what is called acne so I'm not sure if that is acne I don't sure if that is what we call pimples um, but I've given up on skincare products um, I don't know what I should use next I've realized okay um, I've entered the beauty industry because I have a beauty shop and um, most of the time when, when when you go to these other beauty shops when you want to buy maybe a maftaya also um, and then you, you explain your problem to the attendant they will always tell you that so they are not uh, there to help you they are there to do business and that is wrong I have a very very sensitive skin um, the other day I have a twin sister um, her YouTube channel is Maya Safaris I will I will write it down there you can follow her um, she told me that she uses benzoyl peroxide on her skin benzoyl peroxide and by the way she is very very smooth so I decided to go and give it a try I decided to go give benzoyl peroxide a try. Uh, before I did that, I went to Google. I, I googled the, the benzoyl peroxide and um, I, I realized that it is a very effective. It's a good one. In Afanya Kazi, it smoothens, it clears acne vulgaris, it, it clears dark circles under the eyes, it clears all that. So, Nikamulizani, how much? 350. So I went to the nearest pharmacy near me. Nikauliza uh, how much that uh, benzoyl peroxide costs. Nikambiwa ni 350. Nikasema why not? Uh, kama ndakuwa smooth. You see, okay, customer anataka kukua vile. An anataka yani. So I gave the 350, went back home. Um, I remember it was almost noon. Let me start immediately. So I went home, washed my face. Nika nika jipaka yo. Nika soma tu vizuri me niambi apply a thin layer. Nika jipaka a thin layer. Na nika endelea na chuguli zangu and I continued for uh, I continued here the next day. The next day I woke up with rash. Kiasi kiasi tu. Ah, nikasema nika ignore okay i chose ignorance so nikaoga tena vizuri nikajipaka benzoyl peroxide so hmm jioni vile lifika hata haungejua niko na skin ungedhania kuna kitu nimevaa i had another layer on my skin that was looking like an acute allergic rash acute ama ni chronic whatever the, the the right word should be there and i was itching itching in a serious um singe za takuketi nikajikuna 
nikajikuna it was so itchy i went back to the pharmacy sababu it is a big pharmacy and nikakuta pharmacist i told him uh, look at my skin i was here yesterday i bought this i went with it um akaniambia uh who in a behave evil the first few days before yanze kuwak i so nijikune so i sought a second opinion which you should always sort for kama uko na kitu medical things msuwesikiliza kitu moja so i sorted another um opinion nikaenda kwa hospitali so wakati nilienda kwa hospitali they told me that um that there are some compositions in that uh, in that ointment ama uh, there is a composition inside the ointment that i'm allergic to so naweza kuwa nina react na either benzene ama yo peroxide you see so um they decided to medicate me and the medication was um to be treated with anti allergens so i was injected uh, nikadungwa anti allergen i can't remember which one okay na, na imagine labda ilikuwa kina piriton hizo because those ones are normally anti allergens so they injected me and after the injection um wakanipatia pia za kumeza na pia nikaandikiwa an ointment <coughs> inaitwa um, I can't remember the name but hydrocortisone cream nikaandikiwa hydrocortisone cream so the hydrocortisone cream uh, nikaambwa nijipake mara mbili kwa kwa siku morning and evening and that is what i did so by the way by the way, let me just confirm this that after the injection with the anti allergen i got well so um nikapona nik, after kitu kama 2 3 days my face was clear and i was told to discontinue hydrocortisone uh, immediately kazi yake imesha because that is a steroid that you're not supposed to overuse so that was that nikamaliza na nayo but again my skin went back to vile ilikuwa kabla ni by benzoyl peroxide okay my skin has never been flawless so my skin normally has ukiangalia vizuri uta na kukona tu vitu tu vitu yani it is never a clear skin especially this side so um i've been self medicating myself sasa nilisema nitakuwa tu nanunua tu vitu random so the other day i went to to do voice nikaambiwa skin yako sasa umemaliza safari nimemaliza safari sitawahi hangaika na skin uh, they are going to give me a soap this is the soap so this soap is rice soap bade inanuka kama mchele ni kama okay i don't know how imetengenezwa but inanuka mchele inaitwa rice soap So if you look at it sije itumia sana nimeitumia like for 3 days but i'm not seeing any changes um does it work have you ever used rice soap if you have ever used it please 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 kuliko nipoteze time yangu okay ina smell vibaya konge tu kweli it is smelling so bad in fact nikio nikio shauso na nikuvumilia then something else that i've used on my face Um is this Ah, uh, I top lemon plus complexion cream, clear tone, soft skin. Um nilifungua the nini the the, the ointment nikajipaka siku moja. Ai nikasikia hiyo harufu hapana. Hata kama sasa ndo beauty wacha tu nikae crocodile. Ah, uh, I've refused to So that one I got seed kwa sababu hiyo harufu mbaya. This is top lemon. Kwa sababu in my shop people ask for top lemon. So mimi nika assume eh hiki kitu labda juu wenyewe wanakujia wako sawa. So I assumed it was good. But harufu hapana. Maybe it is working but hapana hiyo harufu itafanya paka mtu anaweza shikwa na allergy ya sasa respiratory system. Sorry to say that but kukona maybe mtu mwenye anafilia harufu haimsumbui that is good for you then something else that uh, I, i i want to start using nimetumia jana asubuhi but uh, i forgot to apply in the evening na saizi sijajipaka kitu 
So you see, I'm just as the mosha two so pekeake. So this is made even. Aya, it is called Wamendika Pachini Beta Medason. I understand this is a steroid. Anything that is a steroid, I know it is not something you're not you're supposed to joke with, but because steroids can make the the surface of the skin very thin. Na itaiza kufanya ukwe exposed to harmful, even harmful races in gear kwa skin. Something close to that. I'm not a, a pro kwa medic. But I have some science in me. I understand some things. So, nikisoma kwa hii karata siandani naona, maybe even in as a side uh, But I, I need to be cautious. So, hiyo ni meiweka kwanza pending. This is something else that I've been using. I wanted to start using rather. In it was sheer but oh god is it vitu mbona mbona vitu zina 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 sema zina saidia zina nukanga vibaya hivyo so this is africa finest raw sheer butter ah uh, wamesema inatumika pia kwa uso so if you know if you think it can work kindly 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 just just tell me ndo nijue kwa sababu inayo sijui mtu anafaa kujipaka aje Yet it is already solid. Inaka kama solid. Is it not a I don't know. This is another thing I've been using. I need to dema vio daily moisturizing body lotion for dry skin. Isiyo ni kama kuna vile itasaidia uso yangu but nimejipa kapaka like 3 4 days sijaona change so hiyo tunaiweka pia kando then i decided ah wacha tu nikae na crocodile skin yangu but nijipake na chorol fair na chorol fair na yani kajipaka nikaona na ka white so this is um e cream nilijipaka once nilijipaka once sijaitumia tena kama kwa karibu na mimi hizi sasa mafuta ninapatia na bure sababu i've given up i have this pure almond oil um most of the time i use it on my hair but ninaona imeandikwa inaweza work kwa uso um makes an excellent base for massage and can be used on the face and body it can also be used to nourish the hair so apo kwa face and body ndio niko it does it work have you ever used this and that, did it work that is a question something else i've used is this epidam cream so e epidam cream um my heart refuses sababu inasema iko na kitu ya kukufanya ubleach I don't want to bleach you. I just want to retain this color but I want a smooth uh, clear skin. So epidam nilijipaka once but um the inner most part of me naniambia I'm sinning. I'm doing something wrong. I don't um advocate for for nini. Sisi semi ku bleach ni vibaya but personally I don't want to bleach. I've also used this Is it visible? Imeandikwa anti-aging hand cream, but I used it on my face. Um I think this is a neutral product. Ni kama haifanyi kitu. So ikufanya. Then I used Pfizer. Now let's go now to to where mambo inafanyika. I used Pfizer. If you know Pfizer, um najua unajua ina work. Pfizer nilijipaka kwa nilijipaka kwa uso um the first day alafu unajua kwanza imeandikwa instructions that you are not supposed to apply kukiwa na jua eh that raised a, a red flag but nikasema kama itantengeneza let me try then nikajipaka day one Pfizer asubuhi nikajipaka vizuri uh, I, i i made sure that ijaenda kwa jua Then in the evening I came back I applied again. Do you know what? The next day I was changing. Number one, akne yangu ilikuwa na clear. Number two, 
uh, I felt like I have this dark, dark circles under the eyes. Nilikuwa na feel pia zinaisha. Si ku feel nilikuwa naziona kwa kio. So the second day I used the third day I used. So wakati nilienda mali na kuanga during the day, hey people saw me. When I, hey Kate. Uh, umekuwa mrembo, umekuwa smooth. What are you using on your face? Um naambia ni itwa Faiza. Ai lakini na kuleta kidogo. Kusikia lighten, I stopped. Okay because uh Faiza imeandikwa inafanya kitu mtu anakuwa even tone. So I thought that was toning my skin. Kufanya ikwe even ifanane. So ndo nikaambiwa, "Hey, hiyo sasa inaitwa ku bleach kwa sababu nao unaanza kukaa kama uko brownish." So I stopped. Na pia kwa na sabuni. Na the, the sabuni pia ina wakingi. It works the same as this cream. But now I fear they stopped. And when I stopped, my skin went back to to that uh, form. Then I have this gold mask. Limited edition gold peel off mask. So this gold mask when I say it peels away blackheads and unclogs pores. So nikajipaka nikatoa hizo vitu nikasikia hiyo chungu yote ya kutoa hizo you know the way uki kwa skin it's really really painful nikavumilia hiyo chungu yote at least skin ikuwe mzuri so that is that then i went back to this itana nkanunua vaseline imeandikwa vaseline intensive care advanced repair and scented clinically proven to heal very dry skin in 5 days by the i don't know uh, kama skin yangu ni dry ama ni normal ama ni combination ama si kuna kwa na soft i don't know so my I've used a lot of money you know those that are women know how much money you are able to sacrifice to look good so uh, something else that I do okay that I na shuku inaweza kuwa na cause easy breakouts um I cook food with a lot of oil um like kitu kama siku mawiki unaimagine ukipika na kama mafuta kadogo sita itakuwa tamu ukweli tu tuongee ukweli uh ukiaka mafuta wanasema anga chakula ni mafuta but mafuta is what can cause breakout i know that bit uh and alafu mtu anaweza niambia sikunywangi maji maji na kunywa 
I have the bigger chupa ya two liters, three liters rather. Na kunyonga yo maji from morning to evening in Aisha. So maji X, mafuta tick. Um, I love peanut butter. And then I don't love eggs. So si protein, si protein in a cause. Ju, si pendi mayai, ata ikipiku I don't eat. Ama ata nikipikia my, my kids, si pendi kukula. My kid, I don't have kids, I have a kid. Ata nikipika mayai, si ezi kula, napatia mwenye anakula, ivo. But I love meat. I love meat, and then I love meat ile kwa na mafuta. Now, I'm ready to change. So, please, this video is for seeking solutions. Solutions peke yake. So if you have a product, whatever the cost, and you know it apply na, na work, number one, it should make these things disappear. Disappear kabisa. Number two, it should remove the dark circles under the eyes. I know where the dark circles under the eye come from because I have um, allergies. Sometimes kukikuwa na baridi na jikuna sana. So that one I know the cause. But I want something that I can apply. Kwa ni lazima nikai ni kiwa dax. Wanyo wako clear skin hawa jikuna ingi macho shuali. So I need a final product that will work for me whatever the price. I'm ready to pay. So if you have a link to where I can get that product, put it in the comment section. Kila mtu waone. So that wale tunasumbuka na skin problems to say dike. So if you are new here, kindly consider subscribing. And also like this video and also make sure that you watch my previous videos here we only deal with good vibes thanks so much for watching this video I will see you in my next video bye